Now the next thing is when the user click on this add new menu button we have to display the dialog box where we will have three buttons pick image from gallery, capture with phone camera and the cancel button for the dialog. So as you know we are following the MVVM architecture so for that we will go to our view model and we will create a view model for handling the business logic of the menus. So right click on view model new and let's create dot file we will give it name as a menu underscore view underscore model now the dialog box which we will implement we will use that also on the item uh, when we upload the items so you know that that specific logic will be common be between the menu uh, upload screen and the item upload screen so as it will be common so we can make that inside our common view model here we will implement that so what we can do is we can say here inside the common view model okay as I told you it will be common between the upload menu screen and item upload screen we can give it them as show dialog for image options that is either capture with phone camera or pick from gallery it will be show dialog with image options that is as I told you pick image or capture image with camera now this method will receive one thing as a parameter and that will be the context of the screen from where we call this method so we can say return the return show dialog return simple dialog the title for this uh, dialog will be menu image or we can just say choose image because we want to make it reusable as we will need it on the other screens as well so we can say choose image or you can say choose option basically style text black at e7 font weight will be font weight dot bold after the title we have the dialog options so we can say children So this is our first simple dialog option. So it has basically two properties. One is the click event that is when the user click on it what we want to do. Other one is the child property where we can add text or icon. So capture with camera. color will be gray color and then let's copy paste this uh, simple dialog option that is for the second option and of course for the third option the second option will be select from gallery or pick from gallery and then the last one will be cancel on which the server will click then we will close the dialog box now the features which are pick image from gallery you remember that this pick image from gallery we have implemented that in our seller app if you remember on the sign up screen okay and you know that this is a business logic and we have to make the code reusable 
so that whenever we need to uh, whenever we need this feature where we are required to pick image from gallery we will simply call this method so we have to make this reusable in our view models this is a business logic and sign up screen is a UI that is this is the view so the business logic must not be here on the view just like we did in the admin in the admin web portal just like we did there the same we will do here so let's cut this from here and we will move it from here we will go to the common view model and here we will basically implement that so first we will have pick image from gallery and then the image file variable and also the picker image control X let's move it from here to our global variables so now on our common view let's import the image picker dot dot okay and then this method is responsible for uh, handling the logic of picking image from gallery and cut this from here we don't need it here okay pick image from gallery so let's fix it here now first on the sign up screen where we say pick image from gallery so we will wait for the response as you know the seller will take some time to pick any image and once we get that image then we will update the UI like this and you know that it is on our uh, common view model so you can say common view model dot pick image from gallery so anyways this is all about our sign up screen that is we have to do this update as we make our this method this feature reusable across our entire app now whenever we need to pick image from gallery we will call this method the same we will do for capture image with camera that is if the user wants to capture image with phone camera then we must have a business logic which will be reusable so we can call that anytime whenever we need to capture image with camera so we can say capture image with phone camera all you need to do is change this so this code will allow the app to open up the phone camera that is it will open up the phone camera where the user can uh, capture image the seller can capture image and that capture image will be assigned to this image file variable so these two methods okay one thing which you have to do is on the sign up screen as you know that once the image is picked we do update the UI and then what we do is uh, that is when it is uh, uploaded when it is uploaded successfully to the database which simply means that after uh, executing this method after executing this method we can say that image file we will set this back to null so yeah, that's it and then uh, let's come back here to our common view model we have these two methods implemented now we can simply call that is capture with camera so we can say capture image with phone camera and then of course pick image from gallery now once you do this next thing is to display this dialog box so you know that uh, on our menus upload screen when the seller click add new menu button we can say common view model dot show dialog with option to which we will pass the context of menu upload screen so now let's test our application so now if we go to the add new menu screen and we click this add new menu then you see we see that 
dialog box which says choose option the title of the uh, dialog and then we have the three options capture with camera pick from gallery and cancel so if you click on this capture with camera then it will open up the phone camera as you can see and then if you click on pick from gallery option then it will open up the phone gallery as you can see and then of course the third option cancel it will disappear the dialog box so this feature is working and as you know we have also do some changes in the sign up that is we make the uh, pick image from gallery code reusable so let's test out the sign up feature as well let's go to the sign up and let's pick image so you can see it is working so you know you see the advantages of using the reusable code that is we have only implemented that method only one time and we are using it on two screens currently and later we will use also on other screens as well the same method we will just call by this method name anywhere we want so anyways let's just complete the sign up so now let's click on sign up and let's see so yeah you can see it is working fine Zamzam Mandi restaurant